what's up you guys welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Rochelle and I do budgeting videos here on YouTube so welcome you guys for another cash stuffing video so today we're gonna be stuffing a total of $755 this is another extra money that I received one is my child tax credit which I thought I did not qualify for because I went and like made the account to check if you qualify for it um and for some reason it told me i did not qualify and i was surprised to see the 300 in my account last week so that is 300 of this money and 455 is actually from my insurance um so if you guys don't know well i have been mentioning in the previous videos that i do see a nutritionist and i'm working on my weight loss and stuff so I have been going to the nutritionist and I've been paying out of pocket because they're out of network and um, so my insurance sent me a check for $455 and they said it was to pay for those appointments but since I've already paid for it, it's extra money. So that is where the $755 came from so let's go ahead and start stuffing so first thing of course i'm going to be stuffing my daughter's envelope for the child tax credit so as you guys if you guys don't know any money that i receive for her goes straight into her envelope so 300 is going in so we have 100 150 200 250 300 and she now has 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 100, 200, 300, 350, 400, 450, 500, 550, 570, 590, 610, 630, 640, 645. So 3,645 dollars is going into her envelope. And I've been thinking 3000 is going to go into have 529 I've been thinking about opening one. So we shall see. Oh, and I hope you guys like my new setup. So I did change this. Um, and I put some decals on the wall and my daughter's little cute note down there. So I hope you guys like it. Um, to be completely honest, you guys, this is my third time third time filming this video for some reason every time i finish my video disappears from my phone i think it's because i was opening my ipad at the same time like in the photos so i'm not gonna do that and i'm just gonna um pop up whatever i'm gonna do next on the screen it that makes any sense but let me show you guys so um if you guys watch my closeout video you would know that i was doing a summer savings challenge from budget with friends and that is already complete and the money that was in there went into my health um envelope um because i've been seeing my nutritionist and doing a bunch of like other health stuff anyways so that savings challenge is done and i've been thinking about a new savings challenge to do so what i came up with is i wanted at the end of this year to be able to have five thousand dollars into my emergency fund um, last month i also received extra money from my taxes because the irs said that i paid too much taxes so i was able to get a little bit more money back for my um, refund so i added a thousand into my emergency fund so right now at this moment my emergency fund has two thousand dollars which is in two um two placeholders um and i do use ally bank just because of um their buckets that they have so instead of opening a bunch of bank bank accounts i have ally and i use the buckets so anyway so now i'm going to be doing the savings challenge and this is where i was opening my ipad and i think it was messing things up with my phone so i will just add it onto the screen somewhere so what i did was at the end of the year i wanted to have five thousand dollars in my emergency fund so that means 
uh, starting August, I would, I would, I have to put in, if I can talk, if I have to put in 125 or 150 every other week, every week, basically, 125 one week, 150 the other week. So at the end of the year, I should have $3,000 in my savings, plus the 2000 in my emergency fund will equal 5000 So for the first week of August, this video is late, as you can tell. <laughs> for the first week of August, I was supposed to put $125, and I'm going to put the um, spreadsheet up on the screen right now. So, yes. So, $125, and let's get the money. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, and a five. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 125. So that is going into my savings um, challenge envelope. Um, so this envelope was the envelope I was using for my savings challenge last month. So I know I have an emergency fund envelope, but I want to do put it here for the meantime. And then at the end of the year, I'll move it over. Um, okay. So, and then for my second savings challenge, well, this will be all year for multiple years, okay? So I've been watching, um, she has cash and plans here on YouTube and her and her husband does these Opoly savings challenge. And I also watch um, Budget with Nurse Nay and she also has this Opoly savings challenges. So I decided to do one for my house. So I have been putting off putting money in this envelope for a really long time. And I was thinking, you know what? If I don't put any money in here, it's never going to have anything. So I decided to do the Opoly challenge as well for this. So I went into Etsy and I found this um, House Opoly from the her name up here on the screen. And I'll try to link everybody's channels on the description. So... She has this house Opoly um, board, and that is what I'm going to be using for this um, savings challenge. So, as you guys, I just said, three. I've, this is my third time trying to film this video, and so I'm just going to use my the same um, amount I got. So the last time, I well, the last video attempt I did, I was um, I. I rolled six so for today's um, stuffing I'll be putting a hundred and fifty dollars into my home savings challenge so I'll put the board up here and I'll show you guys where I land um, and it is for a hundred fifty dollars So let's get the money. 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 40, and 50. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 40, 50. So 150, you guys, for my first ever deposit into my my house. Um oof, my house fund and wow this is exciting i feel super excited right now because i feel like i'm now funding my dream home if you guys know what i mean wow this is this is amazing so whew, i just got super excited if you guys could see me i can't even stop smiling right now but i'm very very excited for this challenge i think it's going to keep me motivated so yeah 150 you guys for my home so that is it for this binder and the rest of this money is actually going to go into my health envelope even though i did put my summer savings challenge into um, that envelope but 
um you guys know it's time to go back to school so my daughter has to go to her doctor go to the dentist also i'm still seeing my nutritionist so i still have a bunch of health um appointments to deal with so the rest of this money is going there so let's count what it is so 20 40 60 80 1 20 40 60 65 70 75 80 so 180 is going into health so let's just add it on together and see what we have in total so oh my gosh you guys <laughs> My phone just went blank and I thought I lost my video again. Oh my gosh, I would not have been able to do this for a fourth time. So I think we're okay for right now. So I left off with um, adding all the money into my health and we were about to count how much was left. So right now for health, we have 100, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 250, 270, 290, 310. 330, 350, 355, 360, 65, 70, 75, 80. So 380 in health. So that gives us plenty. I hope to cover all of our health appointments, up and coming health appointments. So that is it, you guys. Oh, this has been such a mess of a video, too. <laughs> to film but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing if you have not already and as always you guys stay safe out there please 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 stay safe and i'll see you on the next one bye mm -hmm.